Toussaint, the land of fluff and wine. Exactly how I remembered it. You will find Beauclair has changed some these past years. Walk about when you have the chance. You will see for yourself. To me, place always seemed straight out of a fairy tale. Knights errant, elven palaces. You insinuate that we are somehow odd? I shall prove you wrong. This I pledge on the Heron! Big beast. Tackling it single-handed? None too wise. Neither is love born of wisdom, Witcher. So, Guillaume, out with it. Which fair damsel inspired you to vow to kill that filth? The most beautiful among them. If he wishes to guard her name a secret, he need not reveal it. You I do not know, sir, nor seem you a knight, yet still I am profoundly grateful, nay, indebted to you for your succor. This trophy, sir, is yours. A giant this close to human settlements? Strange. Well, that was no ordinary giant. His name was Goliath, rumored to have been a knight once, but one who broke his vows. For this... The Lady of the Lake transformed him into a wild giant and banished him into the Gorgon Hills. So he came back down? Why? Several times each year, hunger chased him into the lowlands. Goliath had killed and devoured many shepherds. Guillaume's hunt served a noble cause. At any rate, it's a tale for more agreeable environs. I'll take the trophy. Why not? Could find someone who'll pay to buy it. Put up a good fight against the giant. Got experience battling monsters? None. In Tucson we mostly chase bandits. But I vowed I'd bring my heart's champion the head of a monstrosity, as the famed Gottfried, known as the Giant Killer, did. You don't mean to hunt the beast, I hope. The matter's best left to Geralt. Another challenge awaits me. Yet if Geralt is to hunt the beast, he ought to know. It struck again. The river surrendered a corpse. It washed up in the meander by the cockatrice. Damien Delatour's guardsmen are there already, securing the area. Securing the area? Better go there now before they trample any tracks, manhandle any evidence. Set forth then. I shall ride for the city to inform her gracious magnificence that Geralt has arrived. We'll meet later, near Guillaume's tent at the Tourney grounds. I shall take you then to see her grace. Fighting. Elf Guardian gladiators? Close, but not quite. As you will soon see. Someone's gonna fight a Shalmar? Maybe some bells on its tail to confuse it, slow it down? Whatever is the problem? The beast is a gift from the Emperor, no less. Shouldn't torment the beast. How would you like to be dumped in an arena, blindfolded with a string of bells dangling from your ass? It's the monster. 
You, a witcher. I slay monsters who are a threat to humans. You're out to humiliate one to entertain a crowd. No knight will gain any glory from this. Who's going to fight the beast? Guillaume, the young man you met. Yeah. Mentioned he'd promised his heart's capture a monster trophy. Great love demands great sacrifices. Let's go. I dedicate my imminent victory to fair lady Vivian. It's begun. The fight shall have to end first. We must wait. Defeated by Geralt of Rithia, master of the witchering trade. Behold, as the last gasps of life seep from the beast. Master Geralt, do what you must. Finish the deed! Monster's no threat. No need to kill it. A victor may always show mercy. It is his right. Long live Garrett the Merciful! Pikeman, sit to the beast! Forgive me. I am not as nimble as in my younger years. You fought bravely. Thanks for your help. Guillaume. The lad came damned close to dying. I'm... fine. Not hurt at all. Vivian? Smile as befits a hero and keep silent. Speech clearly paints you. She approaches. Geralt. We must talk. Vivian. You shall talk later, in the medic's tent. Geralt, magnificent, breathtaking. Your grace. We knew that to summon you was a brilliant idea. We are delighted, raffish, to have struck upon it. And I'm truly... Uh, honored. See to our young hero. Hop, hop. For we must make off with Geralt. We should talk. Third hand. A spare? Except it's clearly not the victims. Guardsmen must have not noticed it as they picked everything up. How's this possible? 
Still warm. Blood still flowing. Several monster species can regenerate. Never heard of that happening to their severed limbs, though. More of their limbs seeming completely alive after so much time. Examine the tissue more closely later. Might learn something. So, Murderer was clearly a monster, but not a Bruxa. But then why'd the Bruxa come here for the severed hand? And who does the hand belong to? Why the hell's it still warm? Now, Pout shoved down the victim's throat. What's the significance? And why was he chopped up into pieces? Lots of questions, no answers so far. Need to know about the other victims. I'll ask Palmerin to get me in to see the Duchess. When we appear in her name or speak on her behalf, we are bound by tradition. No one here. They must have removed the body already. The guard brings peace to our domains. Flout its writ and rot in chains. Boy, oh, his smile bum is ready to go. To be born in Toussaint is to be born under a lucky star. Jaws, man like, except for long fangs. Woman from the inn was wearing this coat. In the cellar, gotta be. Attacker had no trouble knocking over the cart. separate claws, spread of a small human hand, massacred by a vampire. Not an Ekimara, though, or a Flutter. Bruxa, gotta be. <laughs> Footprints, small bare feet, lead deeper into the cellar. Hurled against the wall with great force. The strength to batter this down.
You. Saw you at the inn. I know what you are. Don't know why you killed these people, though. Clearly wasn't for their blood. We don't have to fight. You are wrong. I cannot let you leave. <laughs> 